Yo, right, guys, it's Game Boy Luke here, and welcome back to another uh, Nintendo Direct reaction stream slash video. Uh, today, we're going to be reacting to uh, the Nintendo Direct that was announced literally yesterday, uh, 4th of September at 11 my time. Normally, like, it's at 6 ET, 3, 3 p.m. or 3 p.m. PT. Uh, Nintendo did tweet uh, and then get basically confirmed that we're getting uh, Luigi's Mansion 3 and we're getting Pokemon Sun and Shield news, which is great for us because that's what we do here. We do Pokemon, so uh, I'm really, really excited to see that. Um, I'm also personally um, interested in seeing some information about maybe Banjo-Kazooie and Smash Bros. Uh, maybe even some more Smash Bros. content regarding like the new character or whatever. It's a 40-minute presentation, so strap yourselves in. I'm going to hang out with the stream for a bit and, <clears throat> and then I'm going to cut right here. To when the direct actually starts in like 15 minutes. So uh, hit that like button if you guys are excited in the stream and in the video. I appreciate all your support. Uh, and let's jump uh, into the reaction. Here we are. Nintendo Direct. We live. 40 minutes of information about to start any second now. It's happening. Here it goes. Here it comes. Any second now. Okay, wait. I'm gonna. The chat is gonna blow up on on, on this. It's it, it's eleven o'clock. It's eleven o'clock. It's hit eleven o'clock. We we live. They're on time. Insane. Okay. Okay, it's too loud. Let's go. Let's go. They start with Overwatch because Overwatch is coming out to, on the Switch. That's fair. Uh, this is what I'm thinking. What if they have an Overwatch character in Smash, bro? Louder? Wrecking Ball Online. Okay. Cool, Overwatch is on the Switch. That's pretty neat. It's a weird thing to open up with. They have motion controls, but are you serious? They have motion controls. Oh, gyro. So those, those Splatoon players want to play like DPS? Cool. Yo, Divas in Smash, dude. <laughs> available on the 15th. It's still not even ready yet, but it's available on the 15th of October. Hello! Hello, everyone. I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. Hello, Shinya Takahashi. My man. And that was, of course, the latest trailer for Overwatch by Blizzard Entertainment. The game is scheduled for release on Nintendo Switch October 15th, Wonderful. so please look forward to it. Okay, let's get into our first batch of Nintendo Switch headlines. Please take a look. All right. You gotta see these floor oh, Luigi's Mansion 3 takes place in a haunted hotel where every floor has a distinct theme unlike any other. Case in point, Tomb Suites. I mean, a pyramid inside a hotel? Guess we should expect some mummies, harsh sands, and booby traps. As for the other floors, well, there's a disco Oops. floor, a my bad. themed restaurant. You get the idea. I accidentally hit like six buttons on my stream deck. My bad. But there's a I'm gonna move that away. Of bosses to check out before you, well, check out. Speaking of amenities. Step right I thought I said Scream Pack for a second. Park. In this party mode, there's a Luigi team. <laughs> Yo, look at all the Luigi. <laughs> one I don't know team. what it is. Two to eight players can battle it out. See which team can defeat the most ghosts. Collect the most coins. Okay, multiplayer mode in. Double zero and break the most. Targets. In Luigi's Mansion. Hey, even Luigi needs a break sometimes. Luigi's Mansion. I'm with it. Opens its doors on October 31st. Just in of time course it does Halloween. on Halloween. Perfect. Get a load of this new free-to-start Kirby game. The combined forces of Kirby, 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 and Kirby are in for some wicked boss fights. We're calling it Super Kirby Clash. Is this in the same engine as the Kirby? It is, isn't it? And collectively, you and your team will pick four jobs. That's right. Get your weapons, get your gear, and get ready. Some mighty tough enemies await. 
Huh. Is this free? So, get a look at your enemy and make sure you have the right jobs for the job. The key to victory is to know your role and work as a team. Is it online though? You can play alone, together on one system, team up via local wireless, or even play online. Hey! Nintendo's learning! It'll be time to unite with friends and players from around okay, the world. Okay, cool. I mean, Kirby fans, if you out there. When Super Kirby Clash launches later. Today. If it's free, then like, and screw remember, it. Like, I mean, again, 13-year-old me would have loved this kind of stuff, but. This long-awaited, recently released RPG is getting a remake. After 25 years, fans of the Mana series can look forward to the HD oh. remake of the third game in the trilogy, Trials of Mana. I think we already see a trailer of this before, right? Or so already saw a trailer of this? And two companions. The ones you choose will determine which of the I actually want to play some RP more RPGs. When Dragon Quest comes out, I want to try that. Try that. This interference will not be forgotten. As each character advances, they'll have the opportunity to switch their class. Lip syncing is not perfect, but step into the light. Game looks pretty good though. Oh, we get to choose light or dark. Ooh. Ooh. Unlike the classic version, characters have full range of movement, including jumping and combo pew, pew, pew. attacks for each member of your party. Game looks good though. Again, looks all right. Are beginning to turn. I'm really, I'm, I really want to get back into like playing games again. So, seeing a game like this, I'm just like, all right, well, it's not coming out until April, so. Eh. Is what happened to the crew of this doomed ship? What? Oh, what's this art style is weird. Only to wash up four years later in Falmouth, England, with no sign of survivors. England. The, of the crew remains unknown. Whoa, this art style is weird. It's making the video so grainy. India Company. You must board the ship and uncover the mystery of its disappearance and return. This is weird. Your analysis will rely heavily on one less than ordinary device. Use the power of the Momentum Mortem Pocket Watch to turn back time and witness each soul's last moment. You that... They swore! On a Nintendo shit. stream! Observe the situation and record your logical deductions. I cannot believe now, it! The true tale will never be told. My ears! On a Nintendo, Nintendo stream! Little by little, Tease apart the misfortunes of the ship and its crew to solve the mystery. The art style is really the strange. The arrives on Nintendo Switch in fall My poor innocent child ears. There's a small town out there with a big secret. It's town. Game Freak's little town. Ta Never like little ta town. It's called that Little Town Hero. Agreed upon by the people of this peaceful town and the Game castle Freak. protecting it. One day, there suddenly appeared a giant monster. To defend the townspeople, one boy named Axe will stand up to face it. Yeah, why does this game look like better than Pokemon? <laughs> he'll need our ideas. But to win one of these battles, you must know when to use them. Strategy is everything if there's any hope to win. Is it turn-based? During battle, you can move around to garner support from townspeople. Ah, interesting. Take advantage to gain the advantage. I think it's really respectable that a company like Game Freak are like Seize branching out, making new games. So we should give this game a RPG chance. From Game Freak, and almost all the music in the game was composed by Undertale creator Toby Fox. Little Town Hero will make okay. a Nintendo Switch. October Toby 16. Fox made the music for Little Town Hero. And preload the game later today. That's more than enough reason to play the game. Is coming to Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Here we go! Look at the boy! I love him so much. Okay. Pack three, Banjo and Kazooie. Release date: end of the month. And Tomorrow. The is After the stream. Today. It's today. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go, dude! Oh my God, he's out today! Out today! He's out today! Just, 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 just! Hero Sakurai. Just! A special treat. The video will begin immediately following the Nintendo Direct you're watching right now. I'm so happy. Yes, I love this game. I love this Banjo and Kazooie. I love it so much. I can't wait for Banjo and Kazooie. But first. 
Oh, new character! Let's go! Wait, 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 wait. Oh, we're going back. We're going way back. Game watch? Snez. Wait, what? What is happening? I don't know what's happening at all. Dude, I love the low poly, it, like the low the low quality graphics for this. Hey, come on. Terry? Who is this? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know who this is. I feel so bad. I don't even know who that is. I feel so bad. I don't know who Terry is. So, Terry Bogard from Fatal Fury is Fatal Fury. The I have to play the game that now. I want to find out who he is. Five fighters included in the fighters pass. Can there really be only one left? We're happy to confirm the development of more DLC fighters for Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Outside the five fighters included in the fighters pass, we can confirm that other new fighters are in development. The battle isn't over yet. How many? That's fine. So, if they're doing more than think? Terry, I don't know. I don't care who you is. Announced about additional fighters at the end of that segment. We'll have more to share with you in the future. For now, let's continue with some more. This Nintendo game is Switch gonna have like eight, a hundred characters. It's about time to wake the wind. Sakurai the just like, you know, <laughs> which means I feel so bad for him. On Nintendo Switch is but we, need, we, got, we got the five people from the challenger You'll pack, and then there's more DLC items. characters. How many Game are they adding? And encounter some oddly familiar faces. Bro, if they add like another five, then they might end up adding like fan favorites like Gino, and like, I am so taken back by that. You can place chambers earned on your adventure to arrange your they, own dungeons. They saw how well it was Added doing. They saw how well it was doing. Chambers. They were like, we need more characters. I'm so excited. Sans, like meme characters like Sans. Series. Dude, that's insane. That play them. Everyone is here. Be ready. The Legend of Zelda. Link's oh my god. Before you know it, that got me all kinds of hot and sweaty. Link amiibo figure will be available that same Sorry, day. I wasn't paying attention, but Link's Awakening, we know that's coming out. We've heard that before, so it's cool. You know the hero. I, I want to play this game. While Luigi could be in Smash TV, you don't know. Dragon Quest 11 S Echoes of an Elusive Age Definitive Edition is exactly that. The most I want to play this game. Of a sprawling adventure story that allows you to choose between HD and 2D graphics. What? To pass Dragon Quest worlds. I didn't know this. And experience new character focused stories. The day the game launches. Free downloadable content you can, can play in, in the champion sprite pack, form, including consumable items and more equipment that can change the appearance of party members. Bro, <laughs> I just want to chance that. Oh, on oh God, like. <laughs> Dragon Quest All right, fair. Okay, okay, that's not showed yet. Okay, Jesus Christ, bro, we're not even like Switch, 15 minutes into this right now. I cannot. I have to Until keep. Then, I keep touching my glasses. My, my hands. With the free demo. On free demo. Show. 
which I heard at Insomnia, I think they said that has like a good like three or four hours of content in it. I might be wrong. Damn. All right. Looking for more Fire Emblem goodness? Then say hello to Tokyo. What? The worlds of the Fire Emblem series and Atlas games have crossed paths, and the result is coming to Nintendo Switch. Oh, I heard, oh yeah, we've seen, we've seen this, right? The story takes place in modern-day Tokyo, where creative energy is so abundant, it's materialized into something called Performa. Okay. Which attracts wicked mirages who suck it out of people. We've seen this. We've You'll seen this. You'll face off against this threat as up-and-comer Itsuki which, Aoi... We're trying to see modern-day, like, in the Fire Emblem characters. Fire Emblem characters like Prom and Sita will join you from another dimension. Together, you'll wage deep turn-based battles, blending the combat of the Fire Emblem and Shin Megami Tensei series. And in the Nintendo Switch version, there's a new song that wasn't included in the original. Oh, they're remaking it. Be sure it. Oh. to check out the other new features, from the new story elements to the characters joining you in battle for the first time. Okay, yeah. Hey, uh, is uh... that Tiki? I don't know. I wouldn't know because I don't know who Tiki on January is. You can pre-purchase the game later today. Sure. Cool. Welcome back to where nothing is what it seems. Boston, 2019. Boston. It all begins. Again. Deadly premonition. FBI agent Aaliyah Davis opens an investigation into an old serial killer case. She also opens a door. Oh, well, he just looks unknown, like an evil person. A door doesn't he? that also takes us back to New Orleans, 14 years ago. Excuse me. Here, our story follows an FBI agent who goes by the name of York. The journey between past and present will take Aaliyah and York on a winding path. But what lies at the end? Will it be truth or madness? Deadly Premonition 2, A Blessing Wait, in Disguise, Deadly Premonition and one come out? on Nintendo Switch in 2020. And now for a shocker. The original game in the series will launch a Nintendo eShop at Deadly Premonition Origins later today. Come on, 2010. It's almost 10 years later. That's crazy. Divinity, original Sin 2 Definitive Edition is finally coming to Nintendo Switch. Check that's, it out. That's crazy. It shows people that played the first game and like excited to play another one. That's fair. That's awesome. Uh, okay, so this is another game. Dude, watching these streams makes me realize how little video games I play nowadays. And, like, I really, really, really want to get back into playing, like, just playing more video games. <clears throat> In fairness, this game doesn't seem like the sort of game I would like to, like to play. But I'm easy to please as well, I feel, so... I don't know. Yeah, this again, this this means this game means absolutely nothing to me. But for those of you that like know the game, happy for you. Do we get banjo? I get to play banjo after the stream. And now for a message from Bethesda. Bethesda. Hey, Nintendo fans, Pete Hines from Bethesda. On behalf of everyone at id Software, I'm excited to announce something really cool that we have coming to Nintendo Switch later this year. Uh -huh. I'm sure many of you have fond memories of spending countless hours playing your favorite games on Nintendo 64. Well, this year is the 25th anniversary of Doom, one of the most popular first-person shooter franchises ever. Okay. And to celebrate, we're re-releasing one of our favorite games, Doom 64. For the first time since its original release in 1997, Doom 64 will be officially available on a Nintendo console. We live your crusade against the Did I play this as a kid? Action packed levels. I think I did. Or if you're a newcomer, experience the retro first person shooter that helps This you looks really familiar for some games. reason. It kind of looks like Quake. Doom 64 will release on Nintendo Switch on November 22nd this year. Dude, that, that yo, that looks sick. That's so I yo, I, I rate that. I actually super rate that. Introducing a brand new IP from developer High Res Studios, Rogue Company. To most of the world, Rogue Company is a rumor at best, but its operatives are the real deal. And as one of these elite specialists, you'll face challenges which will require your specialized abilities and tools to combat the infamous organization Jackal. 
play mm -hmm. against friends, or match up with a similarly skilled team online in a variety of objective-based game modes. Okay. Whether you wield guns, gadgets, or melee weapons, your playstyle will depend on your choice of mercenary, which can be fully customized. There will be plenty of modes, maps, weapons, skins, in-game events, and more. When Rogue Company sneaks up on Nintendo Switch 2020. A Rogue Company. Yo, they've shown a lot of guns they? Going, for Nintendo for Nintendo next, Direct. New titles in the core Pokemon RPG series, Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. We have more information to share that will shed new light. On Here it comes. Pokemon Here it comes. Games. Please take a look. Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. Pokemon in the Gala region, a scenic land where people and Pokemon work together toward a prosperous new future. Oh, Among Mayfield's them, in the wild! You'll encounter new Pokemon Look at Wooloo and new Roll. throughout your adventure. Today, we'll cover four features you can look forward to. Okay, let's go. Hit me. First, customizing your look. Once again, the hey! latest entry in the hey! series lets you pick your outfit. Oh wow, these oh these are so sick! Look at the Shuckle T-shirt! Wide variety, including outerwear and gloves. Glo Yo, this is sick. The character customization in this is mint. Plus, you can change your hairstyle. Whoa, there are so many styles. Or put on a there's a lot more to becoming a champion yeah, than simply honing your battle skills. Bro, I respect it. Too, they know how important character You can literally make yourself look Second, so different. I love that. During your journey through the Gala region, you can camp anytime at Pokemon Camp. Is that shiny? While you're there, you can play with your Pokemon. Oh, so this is what they're talking about with the animations. Better, they'll also improve in battle. Oh, this is why they were talking about animations. Additionally, in the wild area, you can visit other players' camps too. Oh, that's so sick! Feel free to bring along one of your Pokemon and hang out with up to three other players at the camp. We definitely recommend interacting with another player's Pokemon. Oh, uh, that's cool. Third, curry on rice. Pokemon Camp is also a great place to cook up a dish that is very popular in the Gala region. Curry on rice. How your curry turns out and what type it is ultimately I mean, depends we, I mean, we do love our Indian food, but like, use. we do love Not a good curry over here in the UK. I mean, I can't deny that. There are more than 100 types. And each one you cook up will be registered in your curry decks. The goal? To master the art. We, no, curry. to be fair, <laughs> fish and chips is a staple of the UK, but we, we and love Paul Indian. We'll introduce some new Pokemon discovered in the Gala region. Paul, First Paul T, Pokemon. guys? Normally, it makes a home for- I love it! He's a T Pokemon! I, <laughs> I like, Paul T, guys? Aroma and flavor. Are we for real? And allow a trusting trainer to taste its taste. Oh my He's god. Paul T, guys. I quit. I'm done. Cramorant. Pokemon called Cramorant. <laughs> this I love him. Water type Look at his Pokemon stupid face. I love him. Appetite. It will swallow anything it can fit in its mouth. I love him. When it you uses stupid surf bird. And dive during battle, watch as it rises from the water, along with the catch in its mouth. If it takes damage <laughs> in this state, he's a it pelican. By spitting out its catch at the attacker. This is Cramer's exclusive new ability, Gulp Missile. What? And that's all we have to share with you today. Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield will launch on Nintendo Switch. Bro, this game's gonna be mint. This game's gonna be mint. Well, how about that? There's still yeah. two more months. Alright, that was fair play to you. That looks sick. Look Character customization looks really good. In the gallery. And Paul T, guys? So, it's been about a year since we began offering Nintendo Switch online. You know what I mean? Membership. With Nintendo Switch Online, we're providing a variety of games and fun features. Right. And now, we're looking to add in an additional library of games. It's called Let's Super go! Nintendo yes! System yes! They put the SNES VC on here! You can play a variety of Yo, Dream Course! Let's go! Put all stars! That's brilliant! Yes! There are some you may not expect. 
like Stunt Race FX. Okay, well, which yeah. Will be available to play on another system for the first time. Okay. You can face off or team up in local multiplayer hey, by using a Joy-Con controller to a friend, or even play together online. Hamtaro? Oh, and the rewind function will be available from launch. All right, that's cheating. That's cheating. Here are the first games we plan to release. Am I well? Is it okay? I wish All Stars all was on here. The games you see on but screen that's fine. Will launch tomorrow. That's fine. That's dope though. Course, Links to the past. We'll Mario World. Lineup. Super Mario World, rather. This offer is exclusively available to Nintendo Pog. Switch online members. So Pog. please enjoy them at no additional charge. Oh, you noticed this, did you? No! To recapture the original feel of these games, we will be releasing a Super Nintendo Entertainment System Nintendo Switch Online exclusive controller. Let's go! To charge it, you can use a USB cable, just like the Nintendo Switch. It's like Pro a Pro controller, controller but it's NES the SNES controller. controller. Will be available for purchase exclusively for Nintendo Switch Online members. Visit the um, Nintendo website for the latest information yes, on its release. Yes, I'm going to buy this. It nice to I'm play just like games again with one of these controllers. Yes. Well, let's move on to some more Nintendo Switch headlines. I'm I'm losing money. Sure, you know Tetris. But can you survive I've been this? playing this a lot recently. Nintendo Switch Online members, the large-scale puzzle battle game Tetris 99 is getting a free update. Tetris 99 Invictus is here, and not for the Invictus? faint of hearts. You can't even play it until you achieve Tetris Maximus status. I haven't. Can you survive against the best of the best? Well, Rub it in, Nintendo. Well, I'm not good enough for your Invictus for game challenges. mode. By clearing these missions, you can acquire tickets and exchange them for a variety of custom themes. Sweet! To showcase your accomplishments, we're tossing in a vast array of new player icons, too. Cool. Beyond that, the second wave of paid DLC is here as well. In two-player share battle mode, oh, wow. a controller to a friend for a two-player game against each other and the CPU, and get together with friends to battle via local wireless on your Nintendo Switch systems in local arena mode. The version 2.0 update for Tetris 99 will be available <sighs> tomorrow. A packaged version including the game, DLC, and a Nintendo Switch Online 12-month individual membership will be available September 6th. Mario and Sonic are ready to kick it This game in looks Tokyo. pretty sick. <clears throat> the salt is real. Don't want to talk about it. All right, listen. Become a tradition of its own. I don't. Time, I never want to see a Mario character's year, feet karate, ever again. Football, I... skateboarding, rugby sevens, sport climbing, badminton, gymnastics, badminton, surfing, and you know what? There's more where that came from. Check out these 10 retro style Dude, okay, this is sick. This is sick, all right. Each one rocking some sweet 2D style graphics. They're all new, all retro. It's sick. Very refreshing oh my god, play. Bowser, chill. Perfect? All right, that, chill, bro. There are new mini games, unlockable characters, and a story mode in which Mario, Sonic, Bowser, and Dr. Eggman must escape from a game based on the Olympic Games Tokyo 1964. Okay, oh, they have a story mode. Sonic at the Olympic Games that might make it a little bit more, like, you know, like, every more really play playability. I respect that. That's cool. Please don't show feet on Sonic characters. Yo, okay, so one of you I know that works with Nintendo, uh, when I was hanging out in Insomnia, was telling me he's super excited for this game. Same with Astral Chain, because that came out recently. In this prologue, you'll man your mech through the beginning of the game. And... All of your progress can carry over to the full game. If you've That's never cool. played a mech action game and you're wondering what they're all about, this right. is the perfect time to take one for a test drive. A key feature of this demo is the co-op. I'm just gonna play games, bro. I don't I don't like see any interest in this game at all, right? So gather your But I need to I need to start playing games like again. I'm so tempted to just full get this game, play the demo, play. and just see you how it is. Customizing your mech and honing your skills on because your I don't want to sit here and judge the what game without playing it. Because I feel like it could be really fun. Damon X Machina will be ready for action September 13th. I'm tempted. The Star Wars classic so fun, Ooh. it's back for more. Oh, I played Celeste. Agent of the New Republic is our only hope to stop a rogue Jedi. 
Mate, wait a minute. This is an old game. This is an old game. I think I remember playing this with my friends when I was a kid. That's old. We've got new details on some upcoming games. Here's where my journey begins. You are Geralt of Rivia. And then play the Witcher series, but Your that's cool. Yo, chat's popping off right now. That Jedi game? I swear I did. I, th I swear to a friend that we played it when I played it with when I was a kid. And on the go. I'm pretty sure I did. Witcher 3 Wild Hunt Complete Edition comes to Nintendo Switch on October 15th. And all downloadable content and story expansions are along for the ride. Become the most feared pirate in the Caribbean in Assassin's Creed 4 Caribbean. Black Flag. Assassin's Creed. Assassin Hunter in Assassin's this is that they're like quick firing a bunch of like, you know. Great value. <laughs> and new features like touch control and motion aiming coming I get never Nintendo played an Assassin's Creed. Creed. I've not Bro, I need to get back into video games. It's just expensive. Battle for survival at the edge of a savage frontier in the online free to play action RPG Dauntless. Whether you're a veteran of take your player on the go or a rookie ready to forge your legacy, you'll hone your skills, I've heard of craft Dormus. and customize hundreds of gear options, and team up with other slayers to take down boss sized behemoths. As you can see, the folks Honestly, I, yeah, they just need to keep remastering old games. Keep doing it. Please keep doing it. Switch. And there's plenty more on the horizon. Open your calendar. More games are on the way. You just keep throwing them in our face. Little montage. All right, cool. Oh, wait, I might mute. I feel like I should talk a lot over this music because this music before got me like hard claimed. So I'm just going to mute this part if that's all right because I, I don't want to get copyright striked. Thank you very much. Or copyright claimed. But you guys can see we have Farming Simulator. Cool. Um, Nino Kuni. That's another game. My friend Nate. My Nate, he has a he has a tattoo of like Nino Kuni on his arm. Uh, I'm meaning to try that game out as well. NBA, cool, fantastic. The switch light. They're gonna have to shut off the switch light. What is this? Call of Cthulhu. The Outer Worlds. Oh wait, I remember seeing that. I remember seeing the trailer, the trailer fight. Devil May Cry. I never played a Devil May Cry game. I wish I'd gotten into these games when I was younger because I'd be so much more excited about them right now. Vampire. How's everything going? Oh, bad. Next up, Animal Crossing New Horizons. <gasps> we revealed many details about the game back in June, so we prepared a video covering what was announced. Let's see, shall we? Animal Crossing! Hello there, Nintendo Direct viewers. I'm Tom Nook. You no doubt heard about the desi desert deserted island getaway package my company Nook Inc. will offer. Hmm. Well, I prepared a fun little promotional video just for you. For you. It's called Welcome to Island Life. Dude, Nook is loving it. Oh, it's starting! It's starting! It's starting! Thank you for choosing the Deserted Island Getaway Package. A laid-back, relaxing time in a haven oh, of nature Oh, it looks so gorgeous! Awaits. For you and the other folks participating in the Getaway Package, the time's come to get into the groove of Deserted up, Island Life. It may be it look, a oh, I love the shaders. The resident services building at its center it looks so is good. to support your needs, so there's nothing to worry about. For starters, we'll provide you with a tent. I'm so much more connected nowadays. So like being able to visit friends and stuff is like so much up. fun. Oh, and there's something else. We'd like to offer you an original Nook Inc. Nook phone. It comes pre-installed with a variety of apps for all your deserted island needs, for including me? recipes for crafting tools and furniture. Let's start by crafting an axe. We're going to need some materials. Bro, this is about a game about turning to Minecraft, bro. Like branches. Aha! Uh -huh. And stones. Then we'll head to resident services and use the workbench. This is a little different take, but I like this. I flimsy axe. Nicely done. 
Okay. You can use the tools you craft to acquire new materials, like this. And with those, you can craft more items. This is this is starting to become like a it's like you Minecraft. Can place furniture inside and outside. Or outside. You better make your you better make your towels look so fire, dude. I can't wait. Style. And you can fully enjoy the deserted island life. People might think that towels look fuego. Let's head back to resident services. Here we sell tools and furniture. Camp stove. We also buy your unwanted items, including any weeds you remove. Some weeds. Timmy, put down the in weed. In addition to the usual Timmy, in -game currency put down the weed. Bells, you can also earn Nook Miles through the Nook Mileage program. You can exchange your miles for special items and recipes. Fantastic. You'll earn miles through a host of activities on the island, so Brilliant. be sure to take advantage of this program. Timmy's high now. Fantastic. What a great father. Oh, the hairstyle? The, of the shoes? Yo! Go fishing. Catch some bugs. Tend to flowers. She's styling, bro. Okay. I I love this. This is brilliant. Even weeds have their uses. Okay, that's bullshit. <laughs> Even weeds have their uses. Pulls out a massive like umbrella. No. No, 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 no. snack will help you shovel up a tree in no time. Excuse me. You can't just do that. You can't. What? You can. How strong is this? How strong is she? Cloudy days. She just moved an entire tree. Enough wind to shake the trees. Depending on the time of day and the season, you'll encounter different creatures to catch. She's too powerful, chat. She's too strong for this world. I'm scared. Sociable types who live together on the same island. I'm scared. Simultaneously, up to four players at a time on one system. We I'm terrified. Enjoy living together and working together. You can. Oh my god, this is amazing. Space. On one system. With okay. a local wireless or internet connection. Internet. You can travel to another player's island for a total of eight players. Eight people, system. bro. We all come in a mic. No, don't nobody ever fly to my house for my birthday. Just visit my Animal Crossing town, please. A lasting memory. We'll all crack a beer open and we'll all visit my house for my birthday. All right, that's all I want. Look at him run, dude. He's skirting. Life looking. What we've shown you here today is truly just the beginning. Yep. There's so much more waiting to be discovered. So many activities, animals to encounter, and more calling to you from the island. The Wolfos. We can't wait for you to experience the nooking. Oh, that's so sick. Package. Dude, I'm gonna I'm gonna play this game. I'm gonna play the heck out of this game. March 20th. That is fine. It's after my birthday, but don't worry about it. No problem. So, how'd it look? Looks great. There's still a bit more time until the Indeed. game launches. I'm not worried about it. So make it as perfect tuned. as you need to make it. That's fine. All right. The next game will be our last announcement of the day. Okay. Please give it a look. Hit me with it. Banjo Kazooie. Xenoblade? A shock. I'm really feeling it. Do you wish to change it? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> what? The future. Okay, I haven't played this game, so I'm down for definitive edition. People are mad because of port, but I think I'm down? Question mark? Hmm. 
Monolith Soft's Xenoblade Chronicles, which originally released in 2012 on the Wii system, is destined to be reborn wow. on Nintendo Switch as Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. The game is planned for release in 2012. Okay. Please look forward to more announcements in the future. That's it for today. Thank you for watching. Okay. Sweet. But don't 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 leave because we got Banjo Kazooie happening. I can't wait. I can't wait to see this demonstration. I can't wait to see this demonstration. Let's go. So I, I didn't get a chance to speak. Sakurai! I'm Masahiro Sakurai, director of the Super Smash Brothers Ultimate game. Another low budget, <laughs> a low budget broadcast. Let's go. I'd like to show you all how to use Banjo and Kazooie. Please show me. You may feel like some time has passed since our hero showcase, but we're actually recording this only two days after that broadcast. We sure are busy, even if I say so myself. Uh, he's got like a live action audience there, like. Let me take just a little bit more <laughs> you may remember in the hero showcase, I was playing by myself using two controllers, like this. With Hero, if you cast spells using command selection, any opposing heroes will block those attacks automatically using their shield. So, in the background, I was actually using the second controller to make the hero look away or do moves so my attacks would connect. I feel so sorry for him! my controllers set up side by side, but back in the GameCube days, I lined them up vertically, like this. He used to have to Try do that? With the Nintendo Switch Pro controllers, however, and you'll end up accidentally pressing the L and R buttons. So, even though it's a bit of a pain, I do it like this now. That's crazy, bro. Game around, developers are nuts. I'm my best to control two fighters at once, kind of like Banjo and Kazooie, two characters acting as one. All right, let's get started. He's just like, so he does his shoulders. This is what I do on daily. This is what I do on well, daily. In terms All right. Genre, odd flex, odd boast, but alas. And it was first released on Nintendo 64 back in 1998. Damn straight the character it was. Banjo made his first appearance a year earlier. In a Damn game straight he did. After that, Banjo Kazooie was released. Damn straight they did. Two titles were then released for Game Boy Advance, although they never came to Japan. That sucks. And there's Banjo Kazooie, Nuts and Bolts. Which oh, we don't talk about that. No, no, no. As some of you may know, the Banjo Kazooie IP now belongs to Microsoft. He's just, he's just like. <laughs> Technically, they're a rival platform holder. Yeah. Even so, they were happy for Banjo and Kazooie to join the Super Smash Brothers series. For that, I'm extremely grateful. Aww. They also welcomed us with open arms. That's dope. Shout out to Microsoft. So, if you want to play Banjo Kazooie today, you can do so on Xbox. Oh. I know this is a Nintendo broadcast, but please give the game a try on Xbox. That's insane! And they, oh no! Now let's talk about the music. It's not the coming to Switch. It's not coming to Switch. Has a country feel to it. It's if not we coming to Switch. Super Smash Brothers. It's not coming to Switch. It wouldn't really match the atmosphere of battle, so we put a lot of effort into arranging the music for the game. Damn it! We'd like to play for you several of these arrangements during the showcase. Up here. Yes, here. You'll see the track names. Okay. Let's take a look at the fight. Ah, uh, hurts a little bit, but whatever. That's okay. They're, they're not getting a, They're not getting it. Okay. Let's go. Show us. Look at him! So this is Banjo and Kazooie in Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. The, the, the freaking yellow bug! We're using a special ROM today, so the camera is a bit different from the production version. Okay. We've included lots of actions Banjo and Kazooie use. <laughs> oh my god, I love it so much! Oh my god! For example, the, the talent trot! Let's down. go! And their jumps are based on abilities like flat flip and feathery flap. Okay. Oh, the bag flip, okay. Their neutral attack is called claw swipe. Okay. This ability looks similar to this in the original game, but we've built upon the original motion so it better fits the action of our game. Okay. 
Their flurry attack is a rat attack rap. <laughs> rat attack rap. Their dash attack is a forward roll, which is something Donkey Kong. Yes! Well. That's what you used to move all the time. This move is a pretty useful one. Their down tilt is beat bar. I love the sound their effects. Up smash is build drill. It looks a bit different from their original games, but the animation reflects the fact that it's a consecutive attack. Okay, cool. In Japanese, their side smash is called Harisen Kazui. Harisen is a word that only exists in Japanese, so I was curious what this move would be called in the West. In English, it's called Briegel Bash. Briegel Bash! the type of bird Kazui is. So this basically means bird bash, which okay. is pretty accurate. That's cruel, bro. Their neutral air is... Oh, I like the neutral air! I like their it! Their is an air rat attack rap, which hits three times. Their down air is beak buster. Yes! Which they use to down stab as they drop. They use the original sound effects, it seems, too. As you can see, even their regular attacks are based on attacks from their original game. Yep. The down and up taunts were something that existed in the Banjo Kazooie series too. The up taunt is based on an animation from Banjo Kazooie Nuts and Bolts where Banjo sometimes stretches. Now I'd like to go over their special moves. Okay. First, their neutral special is egg firing. Oh my god! Holding down the button when launching the eggs, you'll do the attack you see here. Briegel Blaster. Hold down the button and it switches. Blaster is based on this part in Banjo Tui where the screen mimics an FPS. You can hold the button for auto fire, but as you oh my god, this his projectile game is gonna be sick. You can cancel it by crouching or pressing the shield button. Next, their side special is Wonder Wing. Yep, as in their original game, it's an invincible charging attack. Okay, is this per stock? It's fairly powerful and will basically win against any other attack. However, you can see some feathers above Banjo's head. So you're gonna use it five times per stock? And I just use up all of them. After using them up, you won't be able to use the attack again until so you can do it five times per stock. That's not bad though. When you only appear above their heads once activated, you'll really need to make sure you hammer the number of uses into your head. Okay. You can use it as a recovery option. And since it's likely to trump counterattacks, it doesn't have many disadvantages. This counter is always stupid, bro. I can't wait. For instance, you'll be wide open to attack. In addition, you can be grabbed during this move. Okay, that's fair. At any rate, keep track of how many Wonder Wing uses you have left. And when fighting against Banjo and Kazooie, make sure to take action against this attack. His up is kind of like keep an eye on it. Uh, Sonics, but he jumps off of the 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 fly pads, the, the jump pads. Sorry. Up special shock spring jump. Shock spring. This move utilizes the shock spring pad from their original game. There are a few things to note. First, you can hit your opponents with the shock spring. Hey, like Sonics up me. Be used to recover, and it's throwable too. Also, it's pretty different from other up specials that carry the fighter upward in that you're still able to jump in mid-air after using it, meaning you can jump twice in a row. So if you're falling, you can use it like this, jump and then dodge, increasing your ability to recover. He jumped twice? In the air? The height of a shock spring jump will change depending on how long you hold the button down. Oh! Note the slight difference in height. Next, for their down special, rear egg, they'll fire a grenade out of his backpack. It's a grenade egg. This is a slightly odd projectile in that it can only be launched behind the fighter. Okay, it's slow moving too. And because the grenade egg is football shaped, its bouncy trajectory can be unpredictable. Oh, okay. After a certain time, it will explode. I think it will be a useful tool for keeping opponents in check. It's treated like an item, so you can pick it up and throw it. Okay, you downbeat, there's gonna be some set. We downbeat, and then you can move around, grab it, and throw it at somebody. Can also throw it back at you. But its detonation sequence is relatively short. Okay. So both you and your opponents will need to make sure you throw it quickly or it will explode while you're still holding it. 
I guess there are a lot of different ways to use this ability. You could drop one off the edge of the map. Oh my god, there's some. Oh, I can already think of like practical uses for this. Lastly, their final smash is the mighty Ginginator. Go the mighty Ginginator is what delivered the. People are saying in chat, by the way, what's the Pokemon trainer? We will after this. This move will send your opponents flying. Let's go. Spiral Mountain, yes! I'm so excited, guys. I can't wait. I'm downloading this right now. After the stream. In the West, it's called Spiral Mountain. As you can see, it's a mountain where the bottom portion is a spiral shape. Mm hmm A rotation icon will appear. A what? And the stage will spin. This is quite unusual, even for the Super Smash Brothers series. Yeah, you're telling me. What the? It is. Anything on the stage, items or otherwise. Bro, the whole map is remade right there. The you can see the honeycomb. The oh, look, you can see. Oh, my God. It's so good. Mumbo's right there, bro. Platforms like this will appear from time to time. A bridge will also appear when Gruntilda's lair... You can see Bottle's house. You can see... The honeycomb pieces. Now that we've covered both the fighter and the stage, let's go ahead and jump into some actual battles. Sakurai! Mess them up, Sakurai! Show us what you got! Spike them! This time, I'll be taking on not just one, but two fighters in a team battle. Oh. Donkey Kong and Diddy he's Kong got the, versus he's got the Kazooie. freaking Jiggy oh, icon. So there are actually two oh, the Jiggy! I love his entrance! Ah, oh, this character is so it's sick, bro. Not. In fact, definitely not. Looks like I'm gonna get. Oh, his forward is min! He punches so like Mario! Sick. His down smash is sick? I should forward aerial. Check. Your eggs, which can be okay, his jab, jab is good. Are useful at times like this. And thanks to Kazooie, Banjo and Kazooie can use moves with a relatively wide range of attack. We'll make good use of these as we take them on. Banjo and Kazooie just sent out, a, just threw a Pokeball and summoned a Snivy. Listen, no, what timeline is this? Get out of here! Hmm. I think we're doing pretty good so far. Yay! I have two really? And since items are on, they'll have twice as many opportunities to pick up items. And since the final smash meter is on, the opponent can use it twice. I, I, he's, he's perfect. I'm quite a disadvantage, but I'm going to try my hardest. You can do it, Sakurai! Two more times. Please stream this! Stream yourself playing the game you created to all of us. Oops, I guess I should be explaining all their moves, huh? Auto fire, auto fire. Ooh, ouch. Oh! oh Dude, I love his personality. Just filled up. You can have that. That's crazy. Now. And. Nice. <laughs> Let's go, Sakurai! Now that there's one less opponent, this should be easier. Computer player! I do want to use a final smash, but it might be a bit tough. Oh, that's good. Does it kill? And There's no way it kills. Smash. That won't kill. It killed at 50! He initiated at 15%. Banjo picks up a Jiggy from the original game. No. Ah, oh my god, I love him so much! I'm so excited! He's ball, oh, dude! They gave him so much justice! I'd also like to talk about some of the da, 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 da. in Banjo Kazooie. Oh my god! Underground by a boulder. Anyway, she's very cruel, and you can hear all about her from her sister, Brentilda. Oh my god! His fate is sealed in the beginning. Oh, the remix is so good! I need this link. He's a friend of Banjo and Kazooie. This poor soul had all of his mumbo tokens stolen by Gruntilda. He helps you out in many ways throughout the game. And we have Tootie. Tootie's here! Can you spot her? She's, She's on there! The I see her! She's tiny and can barely even make her out. But by zooming in, 
you can see all the detail. <laughs> Even at her size. Um, oh, dude, it's gonna make me so. It's, the nostalgia the makes me cry. She's I love it. On the vegetable patch for some reason. And after that, she strikes an enigmatic taunt. I can't die. It's so good. Look at her this way, but this soul is actually the saddest of all the souls. You'd understand how miserable she really is if you saw the game over scene in Banjo Kazooie. Oh, maybe she's not going home? And here come the Jinjos. We saw some of these a short while ago when Bro. the Ginjinator appeared. It is... They come in many different this is my childhood right here. Like in the they did it so much so justice. I feel bad for people that don't get it. Or don't understand what's going on. see something floating around in the background. These are our basic enemy characters called Buzz Bombs, but since they can float around, they're lucky enough to have made the cut in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. It, this is what they look like close up. It's it's it just it just warms my heart. I'm sorry if people like again like annoyed at me reacting to this, but it, it just a lot of effort into these hearts. They gave it so much justice. It's my childhood. It just how many songs? How many songs? Please. Next, let's talk music. Please. As I mentioned earlier, we're taking country style music and adapting it for use in battle. Ten tracks? Entirely new arrangements. I've always thought that getting all this for five ninety nine is a fantastic deal. So I hope you enjoy it. Oh my God! Arranged by Grant Kirkhope. Let's go, Grant! Let's go! I've worked with many musicians over the years, but this is the first time I've worked with a musician outside of Japan. He mentioned that before. I was a bit worried about whether my directions would be understood, but he did an absolutely wonderful job. Let's go, Grant! And here's the list of tracks. This Main theme, Swarm Mountain. Yes, Freeze Easy Peak! Kobe's Valley. Oh, new remixes. So Freeze Easy Peak is original. That's fine. Plungo, Mad Monster Mansion. Oh my god, I'm so excited. 5.0 update. Alongside the launch of Banjo and Kazooie, there will also be a software update. I'm so happy, guys. I'm sorry. I'm so giddy. And to express our appreciation, we've added another game mode, which will pretty much be our final new mode. I'm going to go ahead and play, so please take a look. They is. put the home run content back in the game! And with this bat, not with this, but this bat, and off it goes. High. Maybe a little too high. They did it. And so, home run contest makes its return. Is it? It's been powered it's up done. in various ways compared to previous home run contests, so please enjoy. It's done. It's over. This time, Sandbag has flown 300 kilometers. I He's blushing. Sandbag is blushing. That's if you drive on the Tome Expressway. <laughs> you can actually play with a second player. Let's give it a go. Attack, attack, keep attacking using both players. Bro, he's using two controllers with two hands. Time to strike. Here we go. No. <laughs> this isn't how you're supposed to play the game. When I say two players can take part, I mean friends can play together, and not one person playing as two fighters. I hope you play this with your friends. Sakurai, I'll play with you. It's okay. We'll smash it, mate. In shared content, many people have uploaded their customized Mii Fighters. Uh-huh. Up until now, it may have been a little difficult to use since you were not able to customize their special moves. Yeah. But moving forward, you will be able to freely customize your special moves. If you find a Mii Fighter that you like the look of, you can freely download them and set the special moves however you want and play as them. 
However, this will not be applied to new fighters created before this software update, and only is this a good thing? Fighters created after the update. So I hope you re-upload your new fighters. I don't know. I don't know what this means to me. I don't Please upload new fighters or anything. So new fighters. We will add in some new fighter costumes as well. Please take a look. Okay, what's what are they giving us? I don't use the meat fighters, so I don't really care too much, but like it's cool to see representations from different game franchises in like the, the skins and stuff, so. That Dr. Mario. That's a character from a game I know. That one. That's it. That's cool. Nap. Is that, okay, that's cool. Mega Man? Sure. They put Proto Man as a, as a mean fighter skin. That's more than fitting. More than fitting, if you ask me. Mega Man X. They put zero in two. Vinny! What's up, Vinny? Kanto Kids, what's popping? Uh, thank you so much for the raid, Vinny. Pokemon? What? They put Team Rock in the game! That's sick! That's sick. They put Team Rocket in the game. No way! No, under, no, Santa the skin! They made Santa skin, but you can put your signs in Smash! No! He's not a character, guys. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I feel so bad. They wanted him so bad. He's a skin, but he's not his own character. I feel so, I'm so sorry. At least we got something, right? We've added a costume for Sans from Undertale, who was a popular request. And this Sans outfit also comes with a music track. Really? This will be listed in the other category, so you can check it out there. The arrangement was made by none other than the creator of Undertale himself, Toby Fox. <laughs> Toby has actually visited my house, and we played Super Smash Bros. Ultimate together. Lucky! Lucky dog! He was actually really good. That's so awesome! Guests, he was probably the strongest. Shouts to Toby. That's when awesome. We both chose random and played. The win ratio was about half and half. Or I may have been losing. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what the dude? I love Next, Sakurai. I'd like to talk about a new set of amiibo that will soon be available. <gasps> I need the Pokemon trainer ones. I love Squirtle. Oh my god. Yes, they look so good. That's my main. Snake looks sick. And Snake. I wonder why he was hiding. They will each be available. Dude, they September look fantastic. 20th. I don't collect the Mebo. I don't collect the Mebo, but like I have to get Scroll Ivy Sword and Charizard. Banjo and Kazooie DLC will be available today. I'm getting that in like a second. I'm literally getting that as soon as we're done here. But we've got to watch the Pokemon trainers, and there's a Pokemon trainer we need to watch before we end the stream, by the way. Okay, so we got that guy from Final... Terry Terry from Final something? As mentioned in I'm sorry, I, I feel so ignorant. Terry Bogard will be Fatal Fury, sorry. Although we showed the reveal trailer, there was hardly any in-game footage. Some of you may wonder where the in-game footage is. Well, it's shaping up nicely. But we weren't quite ready to include it in the reveal. That's fair. Like this. Not easy. That SNK Neo Geo opening was fun, wasn't it? It was awesome. I'd like to show you just a little bit of in-game footage of Terry. Go for it. I, I'm down. Let's see. Let's see what you got. Oh, he looks cool, though. He looks pretty cool. Finally. It was announced that we will be working on even more yes. DLC fighters. Yes! To me, it feels like the finish line is sliding farther away. <laughs> I feel so sorry, Sagarai! You may wonder, how much longer can he be involved with Super Smash Bros. Ultimate? 
Uh-oh. But I'm also excited. Okay. Adding more characters into the game means that more game worlds will be added to the series. Yes. And ultimately, that means that there will be an even greater opportunity to delight He is such a sweetheart. I feel so sorry for him. He's putting his life and soul into this game. Ultimate is now representing so many characters in game world that it's become an enormous game. Mm-hmm. Even if the Super Smash Brothers series continues moving forward, I doubt there will ever be an opportunity to bring this many characters together again. He's right. And so I want to keep improving on this record as much as possible. You may as well. Like and honestly, continue to work hard he's smashing it. Developing the game. I appreciate your support. Can we get some love hearts in the chat for Sakurai? Today. Honestly, he does nothing but work for us. Like he didn't have to release more DLC. Five was all we needed. And he goes and adds another bunch more. What a hero. What an actual hero. That's insane. What a what a guy. What a guy. Okay, so there's one other thing you guys are telling me to watch. Uh and it's the Pokemon. There's a Pokemon YouTube video that I see right here. Let's give this a watch. Another three minutes. So let me just throw this up on this screen real quick first. Um, and let's check this out real quick. All right. That's the wild music. Okay, I'm gonna since I can pause the video now. That's a shiny. That's a shiny. That's a green version of that Pokemon right there. I think that's a shiny or it comes in different colors. Okay, so let's get more information on this guy again. What's he called? Cramorant. Flying water type, so he's like Swanna and Ducklet. With Gulp Missile. So when he uses a water type move, uh, returns to the catch spot that's using Surf. Oh, it has to be Surf. Or Dive. Has to be Surf or Dive. Oh, Pelipper, yeah, you're right. Surf or Dive. That's fair. He is a fish. Dude, okay, wait, wait, wait. Question, though, real quick. That's a fish. That's not a Pokemon. That's a fish. And does chip damage afterwards. I love Poltegeist. Poltegeist is brilliant. That's fantastic. It's ghost, just pure ghost type. Look at him. That's hilarious. I love this Pokemon. What is that? That is the most British Pokemon I've ever seen in my entire life. So this is why I think they they couldn't do the national decks because all these animations they have uh, you know they have individual animations for all of the, like, all this kind of stuff here, right? Yeah, like, that's an... I like this, too. Oh, my God! Look, wait! Look at Espeon! Look at the way she walks! With so much pride! Insane. Amazing. She's like a key lime pie. Oh, it can be found in multiple flavors. I was right, it's lime. It's a four-leaf clover with, like, a destroy one. Curry, okay, the curry thing. All the EVs, all the, the Elon Pokemon. So you can make, to be fair, us Brits love our curry. All right, I, mean, I mentioned this earlier, but the UK loves Indian food, bro. We love curry. So I'm not surprised they're doing something like this, if I'm honest with you. Just not. Good Jolteon, he's so ready for it, dude. Okay, I want to see this because there seems to be a lot of custom... Yo, literally... Okay, so the one problem I have with Sun and Moon, right? Is that you could... One dude could design their character. Another person could design their character. They would look almost exactly the same even though they're wearing different clothes and have different hairstyles. This game, this guy looks completely different to whoever they're going to show us next. Look at these... Des look at them! Each one of these characters looks completely different. And I love that. The customization in this game is, you know, this guy is wearing creepers, we have high knee socks, this jacket looks sick, the hairstyles are super, all of these hairstyles are different, I love it. 
I won't look the same as Patters. Patters won't look the same as Mo. Mo's not gonna look the same as Callum. Like everybody, you can change the shape of your eyebrows. Customization like this is perfect because it means that, like, you know, you will look different than your, you know, your friends. I love it. Collect league cards? You know what? I'll even give you one of my league cards. That's how good I think you did in battle. Is it like a TCG? It's like a TCG! There's an in game TCG? And Leon's the number one? Oh, is this like battle tags from like Smash? If I say, for example, if I play Patters and I beat Patters, I'd get his, I'd get his like league card. That's cool. So like if I beat Yoin or if I beat whoever, like you take the, you take their league card. Yes, because you customize your own league card. Look at Rotom in the corner. I love Rotom. And you can pose on it. Yo, okay, I like that a lot. Okay, that's sick! Okay, that's so sick! I'm with it. I'm with it. I'm with it. That's super, super cool. That is super, super cool. Oh my god. Okay, so... That was super neat. I think we got a bunch of really cool content. You want me to watch the Japanese one? Okay, Japanese Pokemon channel. Let's watch the Japanese one then, if you guys want me to see that real quick. Uh, okay. Let's see if there's any difference here. Ooh, okay. Yeah, they're using the same sort of outfits they did before. Again, more customization. Again, the customization is actually so sick in this. All the hairstyles, the eyelashes. It looks so good. I love the customization. Okay, so we're talking about league cards. There's a couple of starred here. I'm looking forward to this. I love customization like this. It's gonna be good fun. That's cool. And then you have the verses, yup. Daibu with the bird. The bird boy. Dude, that fish isn't, it's like not a Pokemon, it's an actual fish. Are we getting this fish, Dust Bull? Pulty guys! He's here. Okay, yeah! Yeah, that's the evolution noise. The interactions they have is re are really good. They have this really nice depth of field too, which I like a lot. Thank you, Pokemon can build relationship. That's cute. New visitor of the friends, camps. Glissapod, look at Glissapod walking around like an absolute unit. Yeah, boy! They have Eevee. I just realized they have Eevee's actual um, trans, uh, voice acted cry in this. They kept Let's Go Eevee cry in this. So maybe they'll do the same with Pikachu as well. And the curry. That's cool. The sausage curry. Look at Leafeon. Leafeon is so excited for this. It's so personable. They're very, they, have, they, they have so much personality. I love it. I love it so much. I love it. 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 I'm stoked. This game looks fun. The direct was great. I'm very pleased. Everyone was saying to me about my thumbnail and like my reaction and being like, it's not even gonna be that good. Well, it was, you were wrong. It was good. I really enjoyed that. Um, let's take, let's take five minutes to just take that, take that all in for a second. So 
My the biggest thing for me personally, because I really, really like the Smash series. It's one, one, one franchise I really love. Press one if you're satisfied. All right. Press one if you're satisfied. I'm excited the fact that they're bringing more Smash DLC uh, past the Challenger Pack. That's sick. Um, I'm gonna turn my Switch on like in momentarily and download Banjo so I can play Banjo because you guys saw my reaction to Banjo Kazooie. I was so excited about that. Thanks for the five, Jimbo. Uh, let's do this real quick. So we have um, this needs to come through. We need to push this through real quick. Uh, Corey, thanks for the pound. Uh, Shen, thanks for the five bucks. Alec, thanks for the dollar. Uh, Shen said, hello, I'm new here. Subscribe to like a month ago. I checked my account. I can fill five more years dollar. So yay, thank you so much. And Jimbo with the five dollars as well. Um, big shout outs to Pariah for the 10 and then Sventa also for the $150 donation while we were live. So thank you guys so much for that. Um, again, before you leave, if you could uh, very kindly hit that like button. I, I really appreciate it. Uh, it's completely free uh, and it does support my channel, the video um, and the rest. So please hit that like button before you leave. Thank you very much. And, you know, do consider subscribing and the rest of it. Um, Sakurai, from what I, I, can, I can deliberate, I mean, I, I mean, we already knew this before, right? But Sakurai loves his fans. Sakurai appreciates his fans. Um, it's insane how much this man will go, or the, 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 length, the length this man will go to support uh, or to, to, to please his fans. So the fact that he's doing more DLC just makes me so excited, because I thought we were getting five, and I was like, okay, Fatal Fury, this character, that's cool, but I don't personally resonate with that character. Um, some people might, and I'm happy for them, so I was like, I, I can't help my like, a little bit so much. But to, be, to be fair, I got Banjo, so I'm happy. But the fact that we have the chance for more opens the floodgates. It's gonna be so insane. It's gonna be so insane, bro. I can't wait. Um, Pokemon wise, we got a lot of really good Sword and Shield stuff. We got like, a bunch of new Pokemon releases, which is fantastic. Might do a follow up video on that. Uh, might do a follow up follow up video on the Pokemon stuff. Uh, which is nice because again they they had to make they had to make a T Pokemon. We're in the UK, all right. And I know full well that Patter's probably popped off about that Pokemon as well, which is really funny. So um, hilarious. Uh, otherwise, you know, I had a bunch of general game release uh, game information. Luigi's Mansion got a little bit of information, like it was like a versus mode and stuff like that. Um, but in general. I think I think that 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 was a really really good and successful and um, pleasant direct to to watch. I'm happy with that. Um, I think it's probably I, I don't really have much else to say about it. Uh, I think we're probably gonna have to wrap up stream here. Um, I don't really know where to send you guys to. That you have there's like 1,300 of you in here. Um, all I can say is that, hey, if you've enjoyed the stream, uh, hit that like button again, subscribe. Um, we upload mainly Pokemon stuff here, but, you know, I'm, you know I, I love my YouTube stuff, and we upload reactions and stuff like this all the time. So if you've enjoyed what you've seen, uh, seen today, subscribe, like button. Uh, the best thing I can do is uh, raid, like, I don't know, if you want to go check out my Gaia series, I'll link the playlist in the chat if you want to check that out. But there seems to be no one that I'm following that's alive right now. <clears throat> So I'll paste my Gaia stream here. If you'd like to see more from me, you're more than free to go check that out. Uh, thank you all so much for sticking around for like the, the last hour uh, and watching this stream with me. Uh, I, I appreciate you all. You're all amazing. Thank you for hanging out. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.